here we have a sorry sight. A young man all alone at home. Who are you? Oh, I'm glad I'm here, Joey. Lucky for you, dating hasn't changed one bit since hormones were invented. Let's get you ready for your first date. First things first, if a girl sees you looking like this, she'll know you're not serious marriage material. There, now you're the bee's knees, Joey. Wow! Now, what should you two get up to? I thought we could go for a walk, maybe? Walking is for squares, son. Pick her up in your jalopy and take her to a nice sock hop or weenie roast. None of those are things anymore. And uh, I don't have a car. That's disappointing. Call her and tell her what we're doing. I know I probably could have just texted, sorry. You want to go for a picnic tonight or something? Oh, great. Okay, I I I'll see you. Hey, Mary. Great to see you. Uh, here. Look out, Joey. She's not dressed yet. Better stand outside and wait for her to put on a nice skirt. Who's that? He's just helping us out on our first date. Don't worry about it. Weird. Well, I'm ready to go now, if you are. She wants to look like that? Hey! hey. What? Hey, I'm sorry. She's just dressed like a pauper's child. Does this guy have to come with us? Honestly, I'm starting to regret it. You kids just don't get it. You look warm. In my day, men were men and women were women. Can I take your coat? Actually, yeah, yeah. Oh, great. The PC police are coming for my thoughts now. Well, I don't want to trigger you or anything, so <sighs> go on your go. date with your Let's woman without birthing hips. God, what's happened to this country? We used to take our girls to neck in an empty field and they'd thank us for it. And if they were lucky, we'd bless them with sons. And another thing, pronouns should be assigned by a doctor in the delivery room. And women shouldn't wear hats unless their husbands died in the war. Okay, boomer. That's a slur. <laughs> nice. <laughs>